Hello and welcome to Drama and Theatre A Level at Hitchin Boys School. My name is Mrs Gale and I'm the Head of Creative Arts and also a Drama Teacher at Hitchin Boys. We study the AQA syllabus and you may wish to pause your video now to take note of the specification code, which is 7262. If you go to the website, you will find that you can download the specification in full, the specification at a glance and past papers and mark schemes. We find that this A-level provides a mixture of practical drama, both devised and scripted, as well as the opportunity to do some coursework, or as it's now known, NEA, and the exploration of the work of theatre makers in full. It's made up of three components. Component one is a three hour written exam, which is made up of the Servant of Two Masters, Cloud Nine, and a live theatre review. 80 marks are available and it makes up 40% of your entire A-level. Component two is for you to create a piece of devised theatre from a stimulus in the style of a practitioner and to accompany this you will write a piece of coursework. 60 marks are available and that makes up 30% of your A-level. In component three you perform an extract from a scripted play and you write a reflective report to accompany it. In total, that's 60 marks of your A-level and 30%. We're really lucky at Hitchin Boys School to have a fully equipped theatre auditorium to perform in, including a dedicated lighting and sound booth. We also have a subscription to Digital Theatre Plus for all students, which means that you can watch live theatre anywhere, anytime. This will help to broaden your theatrical knowledge. So why study drama? Drama A-level can open doors to career paths such as acting, musical theatre, directing, producing, backstage work, technician work, design work, playwriting, stage management, production management and casting, as well as many, many others. You may not wish to become an actor in the future, but drama and theatre is one of the only A-levels that can help to make you a more employable individual in any role through developing your soft skills. Many employers are looking for individuals who can use eye contact, speak publicly, have confidence, demonstrate teamwork and listening skills, all of which are developed through the drama and theatre course. So th some things to, dis to consider if you are thinking about doing drama and theatre A level. Do you actually enjoy performing in front of other people? Do you enjoy going to the theatre and watching plays for pleasure? Have you ever been to the theatre if it wasn't for the purpose of writing a report? Do you enjoy reading plays and researching the social and historical contexts in which they were written? Remember that there is a three hour written exam, which is 40% of your entire course. So it's probably one of the longest written exams for A-levels and it's something to really think about. And are you prepared to rehearse outside of the normal school day? We have lots of opportunities outside of the classroom. We go on regular theatre trips. We have that subscription to Digital Theatre Plus so that you can access theatre at home. We create a yearly school production with opportunities to develop as an actor, production manager, lighting and sound technicians, backstage crew, and even costume and makeup. We host a weekly Key Stage 3 drama club that you can help to lead. And we have a yearly themed arts week, which is a collaboration of all arts areas in the school. And we invest in performers, workshops and practitioners to create art of all mediums during the week and showcase the fantastic outcomes at the end. So you may wish to buy the book that accompanies the AQAA level, which is this one. And also, if you're not already part of um, an outside theatre group, you may wish to co consider becoming part of one. The Market Theatre in Hitchin is a good one. Also, Emil Dale, Queen Mother, but there are lots and lots in the local vicinity and you should undertake your own research to decide what's best for you. You may also wish to read some of the texts beforehand, such as Cloud Nine by Carol Churchill or The Servant of Two Masters by Carlo Goldoni. And also, you may wish to take in some theatre of your own. If you don't want to use the digital theatre platform, you can look at places like National Theatre, who have their own YouTube channel. 
Thank you for listening and please contact the school if you have any further questions about drama and theatre.